Hey, welcome to London. We're in uh, Berwick Street in the heart of Soho and we're going to show you how to use the Cycle Hire widget for Android to find your nearest Barclays Cycle Hire scheme. So you see here on the desktop we have the Cycle Hire logo. You touch the logo and it tells us where the nearest location is. It's saying 89 metres. If you touch it again it will give you details of uh, where the nearest locations are. You'll notice the colours. There's a yellow one, a yellow colour, and you'll see closely 18 minutes ago someone reported there's not enough slots there. The Border Street, Golden Square, here we go. So if we're going to um, follow follow these directions, and we're going to walk in this direction for 63 metres. Now while we're doing this walk, um, I'll tell you a little bit about how this widget works. A widget um, r runs on your desktop. Uh, it's an Android feature that shows active information and so this we show you the closest three locations uh, and there's color-coded arrows to represent what we know about the cycle hire at those spots because uh, there isn't an API provided currently that tells you how many cycles or how many slots there are at each location so we're relying on users to report that information so the yellow means that a user's told us there's less than two cycles at that location the green means the user think a user's told us that it's absolutely just fine so here we are it's getting a bit busy i'm sorry this video is probably quite unpleasant for you to watch but we're trying to do it in one take and make it genuine um so here we are, we're coming up to Broadwick Street, um, I don't know if you recognise this part of Soho, and we're going to head round to the left, sorry we ought to show you this, um, head round to the left, and if we bring up the widget again, um, you'll see, if I try not to get run over by this taxi and this Porsche, and this cyclist, <laughs> here we are at the cycle hire location. Um, and as you can see, of course, the scheme isn't live yet, so we can't actually see any we can't actually see any cycles hit. But when the scheme does go live, uh, I'm running out of things to say. This is hard. No opportunity. Fifty-one meters. So. <laughs> We're having a bit of a fail this this evening trying to do this in one take. But now, because we're within 50 metres, it knows that we're here at Broadwick Street. Um, it's now asking us, please tell us about the status of this high location. And we know now that there's there's no bikes here. Well, actually, we know it's closed. So we're going to say that it's closed and we're going to sit hit the tick and now you'll see the arrow go from yellow to red now if my colleague over here would like to get out the uh, a very uh, a very old and very lovely uh, g1 um, then and touch the touch the widget on here we should see our location being fixed and we should see pretty soon that um, yeah, look, we've now, uh, the, f the first widget is now red, which, which says that someone's reported that this location is closed. This is how the crowdsourcing works in Cycle Hire widget for Android. It's available now on Android Market. It's free. We're Little Fluffy Toys Limited. Thanks for your, thanks for your attention.